Oh, is this? Oh, shit. My mic's on this whole time. What's up? Ah. I thought I muted it. My bad. about the wait. I had a bunch of shit there to <clears throat> yeah, are we on save ten? <laughs> uh yeah, we gotta be sixty-seven thirty-eight. Start using save one again. Oh, I used okay. Here we go. I started using save six again. Jeez. All right. Sixty nine hours, five minutes. All right. Now let's double check, make sure that is.
留到末尾。I'm pretty sure we already did this, but I guess I we um I got to double check. Oh Way to go, Yuffie. <laughs> That's so fucked up. I, really, I need to put confusion protection on her or something. Storm ring. Resist bolt, wind, block, blind, and paralysis. Uh, holy. That's it, I don't have one. No oh, shit. You have manipulate. It does. I'm gonna put that manipulate thing on there because another thing we're gonna be doing here soon is getting more enemy skills. I can't do that. Hey bro here lurking, trying to help someone with audio bugs. Okay, cool. Thanks for lurking. Hope you're doing well today. I just killed my entire party. First encounter of the of the stream. It was pretty cool. <laughs> There's a clip of it. 
you're still there and want to look at me. Get him, Cloud. Yeah. So they, they must have taken, taken four cut out of the game altogether, huh? Unless there's a four cut materia itself somewhere. Which would be kind of weird, but also kind of cool. All it was, I believe, was the uh, the uh, whole cutscene with Zach, Pat, Zach, and him, and him in the back of the truck. I was pretty sure that's what it was. I just want—I need to make sure. Got to make damn sure. Assessment B, Code C. Yeah, man. There you go. It's cool when Yuki does it to them. It really sucks when she does it to me.
Get on my gold choker bow, hop in my highway. Wait, 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 oh, check, check. Oh, yeah, my game's too down. Go down here, check, check, check. Yeah, that's probably better right there. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Alright, the next was a. Uh, Calm and Mount Coral Barrett. Okay. Oh, I forgot what that guy does. Uh. How would you even know? You don't know how tough it is getting sick on boats and rides, so please just leave me alone. I really do understand you, Yuffie. When I get sick on a flight, it's a real killer. When I was a Shinra trooper, I used to get sick all the time. Oh. Isn't there any other any way to prevent this? Well, according to my research, first off, you're nervous a lot. You won't get sick. If you're nervous a lot, you won't get sick. Wait. If you're nervous a lot, you won't get sick? But you can't always be nervous. With this much space, your best bet is to move around while you're riding. Might also be a good idea to stretch sometimes, too. But in the army, we spent a lot of time in, tur in trucks. That sucked. And there's one thing you mustn't ever do when traveling. And that is... Read. Once you get sick, there's nothing anyone can do. I know it's tough. You're a little better off than me. But I still don't feel well. Huh. Debug technician. I handle script reset. Blah, blah, blah. Encounter any problems. Ooh. My hands are full. Well, I'll excuse myself here. Do the fat. I wonder what everyone's going to do when the fight's over. I wonder what's going to happen to the high wind. Howdy. Oh, right, this is a merchant. I forgot about that. Oh, this damn mic. What kind of items does this Genova thing have for sale inside my high wind? Ooh, remedies. I'm an idiot. I have W item now, I forgot. I just got W item, like, recently, so... Forgot about doing that. Okay, Materia. Nothing really worthwhile there. Weapons and armor. Micro laser. Right arm. That was it, right? Oh, accessories. Oh, does this person sell? Fine paralysis, no gravity. Well, actually, I can just. I own these. Yep, I own all that stuff, so nope. Oh yeah, are these guys still in here? Oh, there's my chocobo. You found us. Yeah, I found you a long time ago. You kind of got taken hostage when you guys stole the Highwind. We're going to storm the bridge and take back the airship just as soon as I've woken up the captain. Okay. That's a good chocobo. That's a good chocobo. His food, like, changes colors when I- when he works. Hmm. 
All right, so let's uh, gonna go into the operation room. We gotta put Barrett in the team. Wait, who's this guy? Want to designate a new party? I don't know. No. Is there anyone else in here? Okay. Thank you for a job well done. EHS. Oh, uh, yeah, we're going to take Yuffie out. Or... Yeah, we're going to take Yuffie out. Ray. Oh, yeah. <coughs> I need the slots, honestly, so I might use a fucking Shinra Alpha. Actually, that's not bad. Alright. There's this blunt and auto wall. Okay. That's fine. To exchange. Nope, nope, nope. There, it's up there. Nope, he's down here. Okay, we're just gonna. Move all this stuff just how it is. Easy peasy. Lemon greasy. Oh yeah. And he still has one left. And we still got one slot left. Alright, what are we gonna put in it? Gill Plus, sure. Why not? Get that money. Get that cheddar. Okay, what else oh, is there? Oh yeah, I need to, okay, let's see, he is using a max ray, <coughs> that's gotta be a long range weapon, yeah, yeah, that's fine, he's in the back row, good. Okay, now it specifically said Calm and Mount Coral, I'm going to Calm first, that's where Marlene is and, uh, Eris's adoptive, adopted mother, whatever her name is. You still seem a little down, are you doing okay? Not really. I see you. Well, that's all all right. You don't have to bottle it up. I'm right here if you need to talk. Not really. What? 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 Tifa seems a bit anxious. Maybe you should go talk to her. I don't want to. Dang it. Let's talk to Barrett first. <laughs> Time's got a way of sneaking up on you, huh? I'm shaking all over. I feel sick. All right, let's let's. Hey, Cloud, would you tell me it's all right? Stay cool. Say it normal. Can't say it. Yeah, stay cool. It's all right, Tifa. Everything's under control. Now I feel like things are really going to be all right. Thanks, Cloud. No, what? <laughs> Don't worry about me. I'm ready for anything. All right. You ever see the play Loveless? Nope. Yeah, I figured someone like you wouldn't be into big plays. 
Okay, let's say yeah. Oh yeah, well, got a story for you. They've been doing that play every summer since I was a kid. And I remember seeing it just once. That was when I was in Midgar training to be a pilot. I had some free time and thought I'd catch the play. Now, I'm no big fan of the theater or anything, but this thing put me to sleep, just like I thought it would. Finally, during the last scene, the guy next to me woke me up, telling me my snoring was too loud. But about all I really remember of that play is the end, when the sister of the lead asks her lover, do you really have to go? And the guy says, I made a promise to the people I love are, oh, I made a promise. The people I love are waiting. I don't understand. Not at all, but take care of yourself. Of course, I'll come back to you. Even if you don't promise to wait, I'll return knowing you'll be here. I remember thinking when I heard those lines, what the hell's he talking about? But you know, I think I understand it now. Someone's been waiting for me. Yeah, Shira. When this job's done, I'm landing the ship and then, yeah, that's what I'll do. I am Nanakai, son of Seto. I'm afraid of n nothing. All right, all right. I'm Nanakai, son of Seto. I'm not afraid of Sephiroth. Take the high wind to the northern crater. The gate to tomorrow is not the light of heaven, but the darkness in the depths of the earth. What the fuck? But I won't forget any of this, no matter what happens. Oh no, oh no, oh no. Sorry, I'm in the middle of a very delicate operation. <laughs> Alright, let's get the fuck out of here. We're calm. Where things probably aren't so calm. Because it's the end of the world, so why would they be? Okay, uh, where am I going? I need to go up here. I'm just flying around like a turd. I don't know exactly where to go, so I'm gonna talk to everybody. Hey, listen to me. Shinra managed to destroy the barrier around the northern cave, and they even managed to bag one of the weapons, too. But Shinra is finished. All the top X execs were killed during weapons attack and the army is in complete disarray that was it i guess they basically said on the news that this was the end meteor's gonna fall on midgar don't know if we'll survive this is close to it tourists huh there are a few things you should know that'll come in handy when you travel around the world want to hear what they are yeah sure where should we start oh i see <coughs> okay, this is... Wait, how do I just... There's no... Okay. Why this guy? Ah, youth. You really believe that big meteor filling up the sky is going to fall? Yeah. If Shinra Inc. was our last hope... <coughs> and they've been wiped out. Are we all going to die? Even if Meteor falls, I'll bet that Midgar will be safe. There's no way a big city like that can be knocked down. We just heard the good news. The barrier around the crater was destroyed. So I guess Shinra starts its offensive now. We've not heard anything else yet. Yo, Eris is up there with her mom. That's awesome. My dad's still sitting around drinking, even though Meteor's coming. <coughs> <laughs> even though Meteor's coming down. What the hell? Of course he's drinking. The whole world's about to end. Uh, 
I don't know what to do. I guess he was just looking for an excuse to give up on the world. Eris, it was nice to see Mom again. I told her about our journey and all the things we saw. I think it cheered her up a bit. But I can't just... Oh, Elmira. With everything that's happened, it's a miracle you're all alive. But that's it? Come on. <clears throat> what are you doing here, Kasif? We had to set up a relief center nearby. Most of Midgar refugees fled here. Midgar's finished. But if we all make it through this, maybe we can start over? This is the item store. Honestly, everyone's probably better off going to the Chocobo farm. It's on the other side of mountains. You know? Oh, uh, what? Okay, this camera is just not working. <laughs> oh, I was like, why is my cat invisible? <laughs> oh man, that was that was funny. OBS virtual camera. USB video device. There we go. <clears throat> I thought my stream had crashed or something. I thought my cat was invisible for a second. That was fucking weird. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, shit. There's Barrett and Marlene. This is the Materia store. You don't say. Earth, poison, steel, sense, and heal. Don't need any of it. Marlene, be careful. Be careful, be careful, be careful. I gave Marlene the pendant that Dane wanted her to have. Too early to tell her about it all. But we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. When she's older. <laughs> but look at this. Marlene's got me. Marlene's got me something as well. Received catastrophe. Oh shit! There ain't no way we can lose now. The plan is as good as saved. <clears throat> That's right. Wow. Yo, what kind of things you got for sale that a clever little girl like this, this one here'd like? This is a weapons store, sir. Oh, that, okay. <laughs> this is a weapon store. It sure is. I, wow, I'm just... Barrett is not here anymore. Yep. Alright. Go out this door. That is not where I expected to find them. I thought they'd be in this, uh... There's like a... That house? Yeah, that house, or... There's one of these houses? I forget which one. Meteor's coming, right? Where will I stash my money? Wait. Maybe I'd better take it with me and get it out of, get out of here. 
Uh, I stole your ether. Thanks, lady. What else you got hiding in here? Run your pockets. Hey, you run your pockets. All right, fine. I'll just run ransack this house. Oh, this is the Desert Rose guy, isn't it? <clears throat> the guy that like has the weapons hide quests. Oh, it's you guys. You were all in town before, right? I bet you know your way around this crazy world of ours by now. I'm trying to fulfill my lifelong dream of becoming a spoony bard before the meteor hits us. To do that, I'm going to need a desert rose to hold between my teeth, an earth harp to bang out the tunes, and a guidebook to plan my debut tour. You can help me out and I'll give you the Command Materia X attack. Oh. And then the Command Materia W magic and a golden chocobo. <clears throat> what the hell is X attack? Yeah, that's right. <clears throat> a guidebook gets you a gold chocobo. It's slow as hell, mind. So that's the deal. Get me those three things and I'll fix you up. So in the original, you have to get the Desert Rose to get the Gold Chocobo, which is the uh, what you get from killing Ruby Weapon. So you have to kill Ruby Weapon to get the Gold Chocobo. And this, you just need the Guidebook, which is what you get for morphing the, uh, the Ghost Ship in the Underwater Reactor, which I already did a long time ago, so I already have it. <clears throat> uh, yeah, give me that Gold Chocobo. Hey, it's the Guidebook. The deal was for a Gold Chocobo. Ready to trade? Trade. Oh shit, it's just here in the house. <laughs> uh <clears throat> What should I name my Chocobo? You know I'm watching? No, it doesn't look like it. That's fine. What will we name this guy? ODB. Yep. So is he just going to go to my stable, or...? Fuck. Where does he go? I'll finish up this calm stuff in a minute. I want to know where the fuck he goes. Because I already have my gold chocobo out here. Hopefully it goes in the stable, and I, 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 I'm almost positive I left an open stable for this gold chocobo because I knew I was going to get it. So, let's make sure. Yep, that's probably it right there. ODB, female class C. Cool. I, I want to talk to Barrett. What we doing here? You thinking of fighting Sephiroth with a flock of these damn birds? <laughs> Yeah, I've heard of the Choco Sage. You actually met him? Wow, what did he tell you? Wow, that's amazing. Let me take some notes. What? Let me jot this down. There are Chocobos with a special ability to traverse difficult terrain in the world map. The blue Chocobo, green Chocobo, for instance, cross rivers and mountains, respectively. Great Chocobo, good Chocobo, yep. For telling me that story, I'll tell you about each Chocobo's abilities. From what I see, the quickest sprinter is... It's Goldie M. The fastest one overall is Goldie M. From what I can tell, the one with the most stamina is... Black F. Oh. The most intelligent one is... Bl Blue F. Okay. Cool. I figured it was all going to be goalie. <clears throat> Got the 
the whole family up in here. And then ODB is just hanging out over there because he's the old dirty bastard. Alright, now that I know he's there. Oh, you know what, though? Fuck. <clears throat> I gotta feed it. Yeah. Is it right here? Yeah. Wark. Wark. What are they going to do with this guy in like the remake if they ever t even touch this part of the game? Like, what is this guy? He's just a big floating purple ball. Now what can I do for you? <clears throat> do you remember anything? Oh, I remember great and good chocobos. You can find good, uh, great chocobos in an island called Medill. Medill. Maybe somewhere too else too. Good chocobos are near Coral. They might be some up by Rocket Town as well. And there was a red lizard that carried carob nuts around here. You Or you might... Uh, funny, I forgot what I was... What was I saying just now? Can't remember for the life of me. <laughs> Tell me something. <clears throat> oh, I do have a, I didn't realize I still had a bunch of these. This green chocobo is so green. It's a very nice chocobo. Now I gotta go feed this boy. I can't have no low gold chocobos. He's a female. <laughs> Speed plus, stamina plus, intelligence plus. They're getting along better. Hell yeah. If I give him some Reagan greens, it increase. It'll, I'll get his intelligence up or something. Okay, stamina. First, I have to. I was gonna say I'm gonna take ODB out. I'm not, that's the one I'm gonna ride around. But I have to put this one away first. Okay, what are you doing? Riding chocobos. Which one are you going to take? Giddy up, ODB. Alright, let's go finish up. Checking around calm. Oh. Start at the end. And work our way around. Let's stay at the end. 300 bucks, sure. That's a steal. It's a bargain if I've ever seen one. <laughs> I 
No. No, I'm just trying to check your shit. Run your run your drawers. What's up, Retro Tech? How you doing, Tracy? Did you get that, uh, those audio bugs worked out for your friend? There ain't nothing up here. Oh, locked. Oh, locked. How do you get in there? Hmm. A mystery. You got it all sorted out. Hell yeah. Very cool. Very cool of you to help out. Dear, can you believe it? They say that Shinra's gone under. The world is coming to an end and all because some terrorists called Avalanche stuck their noses in the wrong place. Ah, yep. I, you're, we already said that. Just trying to push circle on all your shit. <laughs> So how you doing today, brother? Ooh, hey, Red's in here. Can't open that or that. What's the little kid got to say? I don't, or I can't believe Meteor's really falling this way. What's going to happen to us? Oh, you really had a lot to say, huh? Back in calm. Oh, there we go. Back in calm. A lot's happened since then. If the world ends... And this small human's comfy bed will vanish too. Very thought. I was kind of hoping everyone here would have cleared out by now. <laughs> There's a lot of locked chests lying around here, you know? Maybe we'll find one of those gill cards or something. What the hell's a gill card? What the hell is a gill card? Is it... Is Gil on cards? I never really show Gil, I don't think. Huh. Oh, an old man and his dog. If something ever happened to President Rufus, then that'd be the end of Shinra, Inc. And the rest of the world, too. Anything else to say? Nope, that's it. Good dude. I'm tired. Could have slept longer for the first time in weeks. And had to get up. Have to get up early tomorrow to get my mom up north. Get your mom from up north. Like an hour and a half away. One way trip. Oh, damn. Hour and a half's not too bad. I'm driving to uh, Chicago this weekend. It's like a four hour drive. What is Vincent doing in here? What? <laughs> what the fuck? Why is Vincent in here? I can't push circle on it again. It won't let me. Walk away more? Nope. That's funny. <laughs> he just goes, cloud. <laughs> Empty. Because I already stole it. Locked. When does that open up? What the hell? You should do what you can to get some more sleep, man. I should too, but you know, I've been preaching, preaching in the choir or whatever. But you know, I, I need to get more sleep too. But you should too. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Anything up here? Oh, oh, spiral staircase. Oh, I already got this. All right. Nothing over here. There's not even anyone in here. Wow. Oh, 
couple of kids in the house all by themselves. That's weird. My younger brother's so stupid. He's so embarrassing. I could just puke. <laughs> I gotta hurry up and get strong so I can crush Meteor to bits. But I gotta train real hard to do it. Ha! Ha! Yeah! <laughs> Empty. I already searched this house apparently back then. Alright, so, yep, just down here and then that's it. I heard that avalanche smashed the Shinra troops at Midgar. Who's going to save us now? I hate it. I just hate it. I heard it on the news here. Midgar was evacuated. It's probably for the best. If we if we survive all this, we can't really we can't rely on Mako reactors anymore. Yeah, no shit. We shouldn't be relying on them at all. I worked hard every day. And now you're telling me Meteor's gonna smash everything to bits? I ain't standing for this fool talk. It makes a man lose the will to work. That's what it does. What are you, dense? Something like that'll never happen. It's ridiculous. Fuck. So well, that's the end of Midgar. Did all my training there. Got a lot of memories, too. But I ain't gonna miss the place. Who's back here? Oh. Oh, right. This crazy lady. I keep doing it. Will they, like, attack me or something? No. One more. Alright. Oh, I don't want to talk to you. Shut up. Then I can't get back there. Okay. Watch this news thing here. I can't even tell what that little picture is. What is that? Is that supposed to be a weapon? I don't know what any of that is. Weird. Alright, yeah, that's it. Here. Cool. But... Part of Barrett's was also Mount Coral. And it said Calm slash Mount Coral. It's strange that it specifically said Mount Coral. And not just Coral, so like we gotta go here or something. Oh, I used a big shot. J.J. Abrams. Fucking lens flare. Whoa, the music has stopped and there's a fucking scorpion tank down there. Holy shit. It's about to get real. But ye hell.
Da, 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 da. There's no music, so I'm gonna sing a little bit. <laughs> oh, what? Barrett's just there. Well, he's in my party. All right. <laughs> That's funny. Should have saved. Oh well. <laughs> Should have known we'd see that fucking robot again. That's all he's got to say. Oh, and now I got a random encounter. Cool. Wait for her. Then do the flash. Then the other bullshit. Noise. So what are you up to now, uh, Gracie? What you do what you doing? You working on more videos, editing stuff? It always seems like you never stop working. <laughs> Damn thing just won't stay down. Yo, Cloud, let's make it stick this time. XATM Scorpion targets reacquired. Resuming reactor defense. Ooh, the music. Okay, good choice for this new fun boss fight. Let's go. Actually, I don't even know if it's fun. I'm just assuming it is. Because, hey, it's Final Fantasy VII. It's always fun. Hmm. Sure. <laughs> Quadra magic baby. Not much, man, just Hopping in streams and playing with emotes and stuff. Very cool. I set up some emotes today of my own. They haven't been approved yet. They're still pending. Yeah, they're still not there. I made an emote of my cat. And uh, one of our the cool S that we're using the Shirt of Source logo. And uh, one of the 